the most successful and influential business people of our times, from Jeff Bezos to Elon Musk, Bill Gates, Mark Zuckerberg, you name it. How did they do it? What's their secret? Today, let's talk about successful entrepreneurs. Welcome to episode 4 of Norton English Show. Today, let's talk about successful entrepreneurs. I was wondering, maybe there's more people interested in that, right? Just like me. Um, I know I am. And uh, the point is, how did these guys get to the top? You know, they're not only extremely rich, but they get to like run the most important companies in the world. Like this is super interesting. But just before you do that, don't forget to ring the bell so you can get the latest videos, right? And uh, in the end of the video, if you like, or if you dislike, you just leave your like there or you dislike, no problem. No hard feelings. Well, so let's talk about this, right? Let's talk about this. You know, from, uh, from Jeff Bezos to Elon Musk, uh, Mark Zuckerberg, uh, Bill Gates, these guys run the most important companies in the world. They are really rich people. But what amazes me is like how these guys got to the top. So I was wondering, you know, how do you do that? How do you get to be the, uh, that rich? that's successful, right? And they also get to be so famous, but that's not so important. The important is like how they get to run the biggest companies. How did they get there? So like, for example, if you get Jeff Bezos, for instance, Jeff Bezos uh, started selling books from his garage. You know, he, uh, he runs Amazon. You, know, you probably have heard of Amazon. Now you can buy not only books, but you can buy like pretty much anything, right? And, uh, and now he's also, um, you know, running uh, another company called Blue Origin. And this, uh, this company wants to go to Mars in 2024, if I'm not mistaken. So they are in the space race, right? Which leads us to uh, SpaceX, another super cool company. That's um, now you are going to remember his name, Elon Musk. You know, he started with PayPal, right? He started with PayPal and after he sold this company and now he not only has SpaceX, but also another technological company called Tesla, Tesla Motors, right? Electric cars, you know, self-driving cars. This is really cool. But then you go to Bill Gates, you go to Mark Zuckerberg, you know, Sir Richard Branson, you know, there are lots of names here. How did these guys get to be so successful? And so I, I'm going to bring two ideas here to you, right? So I want to know if, if you agree with me. So let's get to, let's get to it. And uh, after, after the video, you can even comment or, you know, tell me what you think, if there are other things that I didn't mention or, well, let's start with this, this one. It might be because of work ethic. So what is work ethic? Um, don't confuse it with someone who is workaholic, you know, because if you are a workaholic, you like, you, you, you work too much, right? It's, uh, it's over the limit, right? Maybe you should be taking some time off, going out with your family. I don't know. So, um, no, I think the point here is like having good habits, you know, that lead to, uh, a, a, a good productivity, right? You produce a lot, you get to get good results and uh, you avoid procrastination. What is procrastination? When you stop uh, for no reasons, for like for or for any reasons, right? And um, and this is important. Like when you guys get to be a little more persistent, uh, persistent, you get to be a little more uh, productive, right? Productive. So so this might be one of the reasons these guys got to be so successful. Um, 
one of the reasons they work so much and they try to get their work like so well done might be because of their passion because they love what they do passion right you love what you do and it makes you work more and more or maybe in a better way every time so this also leads a little to a little more to discipline right you get to be a little more disciplined so this also could be one of the reasons i'm sure that these guys at least in the beginning maybe now you wouldn't say they work with these like really basic things but i'm sure they work a lot so this is one thing on the other hand you might say that this is because of their vision vision is something that these guys had from the beginning like i told you uh, jeff bass start selling books like you think okay do you have people have been selling books for ages now but like how did he how did he get to be so famous and so successful you know maybe he he saw something different he had this vision he had a big dream you know other people like wanted to continue start uh, continue to com they wanted to continue selling books and he he knew that was not the end it was just the beginning so maybe this is also like you know like your vision is also how you communicate your vision you know because this is also something that you have to think like it, it, it's not only on you you know it's only your employees the, your your the people who work for you you know, if you are a leader, a real leader, if you have a vision, this might motivate other people, your employees, the people who work for you. So this is maybe not how you are, but how you look, how you show yourself to the world, to your employees, and this is how you sell your product. So maybe this changes how people see you. In a long term, this is how you shape your world you're not yourself you are your vision you are how you see yourself so this could be a second option like what do you think now do you think the most important reason why these guys got to be so famous was because of one work ethics like like for example this these good habits and learning how to do it like working long hours long nights or waking up like very early or do you think they were like very um innovative you know like they, they they knew where they wanted to be like in 50 years like or 10 years you know so what do you think is the most important reason how did these guys get to be so successful so leave your opinion on the comments below tell me what you think do you think i'm right do you think i'm wrong i'm super happy i'm super excited that you're gonna share your feelings your thoughts with me so i guess i see you next time bye bye